And let's see how the find index and the find last index works in array of JavaScript. So using find index, we can pass a predicate function which will perform some certain operation and checks it satisfied the current conditions or not and returns us the index, the position from the array. The find last index also does the same, but it only the difference is it does this from the end of the array. Let's try to understand with an example here. So in this example, we are having a simple array which are holding five values and the index start from zero and the index ends at four. And a simple function here we are returning that is find index in which we are trying to get the index position of the first even number out of our array. So the execution will start for the one first element here, which is at the zeroth index in which my condition is returning false. So we'll go to the next element over here. And now at this particular element, the condition satisfied and the predicate function is returning true. So what the find function will do, it will get the current index and now it will return you as a result. This is how the find index will work and it will give you the first position which is matching your condition. Even though there can be more at the fourth position here, the fourth element, the position three, but it will not go there because as soon as the first condition is satisfied, it will terminate its execution and return you the first result itself. In the second case, let's understand we are having an array in which there is no even number and we are trying to figure out the index of an even number. So this find index function will iterate through each and every element by using it predicate function for comparison in this way, but nowhere else it is able to detect a true out of the predicate because all are the odd numbers. In that case, the find index will return you minus one. In the find last index, the similar scenario happens in which if we are again trying to figure out the even number in our array by using find last index, so it will start the execution by from the end of the array. So firstly, it will go to the fifth element over here. Then condition is not matching. Then it will go to the fourth element of your array. Then the condition match. In that case, it will take the current index three and it will give you as a result. So this is how the find index and the file last index work. So let's try to implement an example for this. So here is my index variable array dot find index. Let me write the predicate function. Perfect. And consume. Yes, we are able to get the first element over here. It means the position one. So this is the zeroth position. This is the first position. After that, let's try to do and figure out something which is not available in our array itself. So let me just change this array to some odd numbers completely. Seven, nine. Now we should get minus one because nowhere in this particular array, we are getting an even number. So it's returning a minus one. And now let me try with the even number itself, but the finding I want to do from last to the first. So firstly, this five will be get compared, then four, then three like this. But at the four itself, we are getting the condition satisfied. So in the index of the four is three, that we will get returned. That's perfect. So this is how the find index and the find last index works in JavaScript using which we can perform some certain conditional operation to perform on each and every element of your array and it will return you the index.